come on then, <clears throat> the dreaded bear lie. You've missed the green and it's on a bit of mud. You've got no grass. This is probably the most intimidating shot in golf. So I'm gonna run through a couple of ways that's gonna build your confidence up when playing this shot off a bear lie. Now I am gonna use a cart path. The reason for that is there's gonna be no margin forever. Probably not gonna pull the perfect shot off here, but it requires total perfection on the strike. So there's a couple of things that you should be doing to pull this shot off. Number one is having the right club. And what I mean by that is the sole of the club face. The sole on this sand wedge, this is a ping, it's an i3. We bought this on eBay, it was five quid. But the sole is flat. You don't want to be using anything with a bit of bounce on it because look what's going to happen when you come through the ball. This is my phone case. Look, it's sitting flush. You've got to get it flush so you get the right strike. If you've got the club up because it's got a bit of bounce on it, it's going to be like that. So you've got to blade it. So this is the most important thing. When you address it, it's got to be sitting like that. So the ball, the club, sorry, can collect the ball on the way through, maintaining the angle like in my other video. Okay? So that's what you need is a flat sole. And number two is the ball. You've got to use a soft golf ball. Using a hard ball like a pinnacle, it's going to be like hitting a bauble on a Christmas tree. You can't do that with short game shots. I'd rather have um, control over power any day. Now with this type of shot, everybody's scared of it. So don't be scared when you try to work on this. You've got to get the strike right. Now to get the strike right, you need a brisk contact, not a stab. We don't want to stab like that. We don't want lifting up, helping it up because it's on a bare line. People trying to help it up. We want a nice one, two. So we want one, two, one, two, one, two. Okay. The action is the same as a bunker shot, but I'm going to have this face a bit squarer. So I'll run through that now. So one, two, one, two, one, two. So again, one, two. So one more, one, two. Now I took that one a little bit, but that's the most important thing. I can't stress that enough is you've got to keep this leading edge coming through on the bare line. If this is you, that's because you've broken that angle down. The club's come up and it's thinned it over the back. You've got to keep the angle. Now you don't have to practice on the cart path, but that is extreme. If you can get a cheap club with a flat sole when you get a bare lie on the mud, it's going to feel so much more, going to give you, sorry, so much more confidence to hit it, especially when it's on the grass here. When you've got a slightly, I mean, that's a tighter lie, but it's not tight, but it's going to give you so much more confidence to play the shot. That felt so good because I had no grass before. So work on that. If you're scared, ring me. I'll get your hands, we'll get the, leading edge in the correct position to pull that shot off and it's going to make you feel so good because that's such a hard shot.